I'm Olivia Gonzalez Britt covering your community in Oceano and this San Luis Obispo County Sheriff's substation has a new commander. I sat down to speak with him about his role and found out he'll be focusing on storm preparedness and keeping crime in the community low. If there's any kind of emergency, they'll come really fast to take care of it. Neighbors in this community of Oceano are grateful to have a sheriff substation in the area to take care of crime activity. The pandillas de los cholos. There were gangs and stabbings, but all of that has gone away when they moved the substation to this area. Historically, there had been, um, you know, a couple gangs um, in our South County region, and our substation has been um, focused on reducing crime associated with that. And Commander Ian Doughty is committed to continuing efforts to tackle crime in the area. And we also work closely with our spe special operations unit, our gang task force, uh, for sharing of information and working with investigations. Doughty was promoted in August and then in early November was assigned to the South Station in Oceano. Apart from crime, his focus is on storm preparedness. Following last year's rains, which caused Arroyo Grande Creek to rise and break through the levee, leading to flooding and evacuations for Oceana residents. And that's why this year we are looking to be proactive in um, engaging with County OES, engaging with, um, you know, any of the public works and any other aspects of the community about the potential for that. Dottie expresses enthusiasm for working in this station and serving a new community. As for the future of other San Luis Obispo County Sheriff's substations, such as the one approved in Nipomo earlier this year, County Budget Director Lisa Ho says $1.2 million has been allocated for the design phase of the project. If you have any news tip or story idea, feel free to call the number on your screen or email us at newstips at ksby.com. In Oceano, Olivia Gonzalez-Britt, KSPY News.